So number one, find dy over dx. This is first derivative and this one is second derivative for each of the following function. So basically what you need to do is that from y, so we differentiate to become dy over dx and differentiate dy over dx to become d square y over dx sorry dx square so first derivative second derivative so that is how you do d square y over dx square so we know that to do differentiation so first we need to bring power forward okay after bring the power forward and then we minus the power with 1 so bring the power forward minus the power with 1 so for a y is equal to 3x4 minus 5x square plus 2x minus 1 so for here the first one we bring the power forward for we bring forward we multiply with very with the constant in front of x so 4 times 3 is 12 12 x and then we minus the power with 1 so 4 minus 1 is 3 okay so here we have minus here and then 2 we bring forward we multiply with the constant 2 times 5 is 10 and then we minus the power with 1 2 2 2 minus 1 is 1 or just x you don't need to write 1 so plus so for 2x x is actually x power of 1 so 1 times 2 is 2 and then x will become x power of 0 x power of 0 is actually 1 because we know that anything power 0 so a anything power 0 is equal to 1 so and constant will become 0 which is equal to 12x cubed minus 10x plus 2 because this one is 2 times 1 we get 2 back so now to get d square y over dx square d square y over dx square so we are going to differentiate this one so 12x cubed so we bring the power forward 3 we bring forward multiply with constant 3 times 12 we get 36 so x power of 3 we minus the power with 1 3 minus 1 is 2 Okay, now done with this one. So this one we have minus 10. So we know when we have x, after we differentiate, we will only get the constant. So this is the same. We see here 2x. When we differentiate, we get 2x power of 0, right? So we get 2. So basically, when you have x, after you differentiate, you are left with the constant only 10. Right? And then 2, without x, you will become 0. So this is the answer. Okay, now then B, so B, okay, then, okay, now B, so B, Y is equal to 4X square minus 2 over X. So, to do differentiate, differentiation, we need to bring the power up. So, here, because we need to bring the power forward, so it will be easier if uh, we don't have any denominator like this. So, this one, 4X square minus, so, this one is actually power of 1, right? When we bring it up, the power become negative. Now, we can do differentiation. So, here, so we bring the power forward. 2 times 4, we get 8. And then, x, power of 2, 2 minus 1, we get 1. So, x power of 1, actually, you don't need to write because we know that anything power of 1, you will get the value back. Okay, now done with this one. So, this one is minus. So, here, negative 1, we bring forward. Negative 1 times 2, we get negative 2. This one is negative 2. Or if you can see negative and negative, you can directly write plus or say also can. So, this one minus this one, you get negative 2. So, x, now you have negative 1. Negative 1 minus 1. Right? Because we have to minus the power with 1. So, now we have 8x. This one negative, negative, positive. 2x negative 2. After we settle doing this, now we bring it down. 8x plus 2 over x square. So this one is dy over dx.
Now, to get d square y over dx square, so we get dy over dx for this one, right? But then, to, uh, to integrate, uh, to differentiate, we need to use this one. So, we need to bring the power up. We are using this one, 8x plus 2x negative 2. So, here, we have 8x, right? When we differentiate, when we have only x, we will get 8. And then, we have plus, right? So, here we have negative 2. Negative 2, we bring forward. Negative 2 times 2, we get negative 4, right? And then, we minus the power with 1. So, we have x negative 2 just now, minus 1. So, here we have 8 plus, sorry, 8 plus and minus, we get minus directly. This one is 4, x negative 3. So, which is 8 minus 4. This one can bring it down. So, we come. 8 minus 4 over x cubed, right? So, see, we have y is equal to 3x plus 2 power of 8. So, we know that, okay, when we have power here, so dy over dx is equal to, so what we need to do when we want to differentiate, we bring the power forward first right so first don't touch this one so we differentiate uh, but don't uh, differentiate don't touch anything inside here so 8 we bring forward this one is actually 1 8 times 1 is 8 now we have 3x plus 2 then we minus the power with 1 8 minus 1 just write it okay so after you do this now only you can differentiate what is inside the box so now you differentiate inside the box okay so now you have a 3x plus 2 power of 7 so when you differentiate 3x you get 3 right when you differentiate 2 it will become 0 now you have 24 3x plus 2 power of 7 so this one is dy over dx so now d square y over dx square is equal to so now doing this one so same like before when we have this one power we bring, uh, we take the power we multiply with in front we bring forward 7 times 24 you are going to get 7 times 24 168 so this one is 168 3x plus 2 and then you have 7 right you minus the power with 1 7 minus 1 don't touch anything inside later on after you finish doing this now only you can differentiate what is inside. I put d over dx because we haven't differentiated this one. We need to differentiate but I haven't differentiated so I put d over dx. Or you can directly differentiate and put it here. So here I have 1, 6, 8, 3x plus 2, power of 6. So when I differentiate 3x, I get 3, differentiate 2, get 0. So here 1, 6, 8 times 3. I get 504 because this one number and number. So here 3x plus 2, power of 6.